If you guys want to drive like me right now, 20,000 meters in the game with no engine, no radiator, no wheels, going thousands and thousands miles an hour, this video is not sped up. I'll be showing you guys how to do that in this video right now. It's really, really easy to do this glitch and I highly recommend you guys doing it before it does get patched. By doing this in this video, you are able to go ahead and get yourself all the way to the very end of the game. If you do not do this now guys, what will basically happen is that you will be struggling when it is patched. It's really hard to play this game and meaning that there's a glitch like this in the game, it makes it crazy guys. Like I'm the first person to figure out this glitch and I know how to actually do the glitch so you guys can do it. So I'm going to show you how you do this glitch but I highly recommend you liking and subscribing to my channel because it did cost me a lot of robux to actually figure out how to do this glitch so yeah i'm gonna show you to it right now guys so yeah let's just get stuck right in in order to do this glitch guys unfortunately it's kind of unfortunate but once you do get to 10,000 meters this is how you do it so basically guys you might, um, it's gonna take you a while to get to 10,000 meters, okay? But everybody tries to get to 15,000 meters in the game. 15,000 meters is where the welcome camp is and you can complete the game. So once you get to 10,000 meters, there is a outpost. In the outpost, guys, there's soldiers. Make sure you are listening carefully now. So, I went to the outpost, as you can obviously see. And this is how you do the glitch. Make sure you listen in. So... Drive your car into the outpost, make sure the soldiers shoot your engine and radiator. So once the soldiers in the outpost area shoot your engine, this is what happens. So when they do shoot, the soldiers shoot your car and stuff disappears from the car. So basically what happens guys is that the soldiers shoot the engine of the car and the radiator and it disappears. And for some reason, they've not made a script in the game, so the car doesn't stop driving when the engine stops. I'm pretty sure it literally just removes, guys. When I'm pretty sure in the script there's some sort of glitch where you shoot the engine, and then the engine just, like, completely bugs out. Because I got shot, I was driving through the outpost, I lost the engine and the radiator, the car was still driving. And... I literally barely had any fuel in my car and now you can obviously see on the screen I'm driving millions I'm not even joking I am going really really fast this footage that you see on the screen right now is not sped up I am going millions of miles an hour without a engine in the car I'm not entirely sure why it goes that fast without an engine maybe because They've made it in the script where when you get shot by the car and the engine removes, I'm pretty sure they just remove the speed of the engine so the car just goes infinite speed. The only reason I couldn't go faster guys, I could go really fast. I'm not even joking, if the road was straight and there's no bricks in the road so I didn't crash, I could probably break the game. My computer was literally about to blow up guys by just driving at this speed. So, yeah, if you want to do the glitch, guys, just go to the outpost, get shot by one of these enemies, and the engine should disappear, as well as the radiator, and you can go, like, quadrillion moles an hour. So, it's pretty funny. So, yeah, there you guys go.